What's up, Camden County? Allison Shores, Camden County Chamber of Commerce, and we are back with another episode of Get In Your Business. And today we are with Full Armor Training. So, Mr. Jimmy, thank you for joining me today. So let's talk about Full, Ar full Armor Training. So what, what is it that you do? Well, we do a lot of things. Um, I think a lot of people think we just do firearms. I mean, I was I was wondering where the guns were, but yeah. okay, so it's not just firearms. What yeah. else is it? We do leadership training. We what? do team team building. We also do defensive tactics for women. We do training for real estate agents as, as they go out into the field. We do a lot of things, communication skills. All this training experience came from my time working for the federal government. Now, how long were you with the federal government? I was actually with the United States Park Police as a criminal investigator for 28 years. 28 years? Yeah, then uh, I was doing such a great job. Right. Fletchy heard about it, the Federal mm -hmm. Law Enforcement mm -hmm. Training Center, and they offered me a job down here teaching. So I left the federal government in uh, San Francisco. Okay. They gave me 10 days to get here. I started working at Fletchy, never had a break in uh, service, and I worked wow. there for 18 years, and uh, it was a great time. Okay. Yeah, so. All right. So you have all these classes um, that you can train. Now, what what kind of training do you really offer? The majority of our finances come in from the leadership piece. Really? Yeah. We travel all over the world, United States, teaching behavior style analysis, team building, uh, communication skills, and things like that. Telling people how to get along with their coworkers per se, and uh, that is something that's in demand now. Yeah. Everybody. Uh, the, uh, shows at least four different personality traits. So we teach people how they can get along, why they don't get along, and try to develop team building skills. And I think too, there's, you know, sometimes there's a huge age gap difference. So yeah. I, do you help with learning, you know, some of the millennials with the, with oh, the older yeah. people? Yeah. We, we tell the older folks <laughs> yeah. how to deal with the younger folks, yeah. how the younger folks, how to deal with the older folks. It's all designed for training, specifically designed for the agency or the, the company and they tell us what they want and we get put together a program for them to present. Oh, so it's, it can be, um, it, it can change a little it bit can be based catered on what to they need. That's what I was saying. We hearing. just got back from uh, three weeks in the Caribbean. Uh, oh, okay. And working for the State Department, teaching leadership skills to the management of the St. Lucia Police Department for two weeks. Then we went to Barbados and did the same thing. So it's a State Department funded program. They mm -hmm. contacted us to do it. Gotcha. We've done this training in Ghana. We've done it in uh, so uh, not Saudi Arabia. Uh, UAE. Mm -hmm. We used to go over there twice a week. We do uh, twice a month to uh, I mean twice a year to teach a five week program oh, wow. for leadership to their intelligence service. Kind of keep it under the table. Yeah, yeah. secret, so, secret. Yeah. Okay, so locally you can still provide all these things because I know you're doing it on a huge scale, but you can also like oh, yeah. locally you want to help these local businesses and some of their struggles right. with with some of this stuff. Oh, so. Yeah. But you also have the firearm training. Yeah, the firearms training. We, uh, since Georgia has gone to, you don't need a concealed carry permit anymore. Okay. That's kind of knocked our business down gotcha. because people are just going buying guns. The problem is they don't know Ooh. when, where, and how to use those firearms. What type of gun is best for them? That's what I was gonna say. Hey, so we help people do that. We've had people in our classes. They come to, to the class. They say, "My husband bought me this new gun. He really yeah. likes it." <laughs> yep. Well, the, the, the person doesn't doesn't like it. They don't know. They can't even pull. Or they might not be comfortable with it in their hands. Right. Hand, right. Or, yeah. So we talk about things like that. We have many different types of firearms. People can hold. And if you want to go further with that gun, we can take you to the range and show you how to shoot and things like that. So it's uh we still do it for Florida and for Georgia. Mm -hmm. We've traveled to other states to do it. Okay. Depending on what state you're in, each state has its own requirement for carrying a concealed carry and uh, carrying a concealed firearm. So it's if you carry a firearm, you should know the law. You should and know a lot the law. Of people, and you should know how to use it. How to use it and when to use, use it. it. Yes. Because you can use your firearm and go to jail. Yeah. And people don't Very understand true. that because mm -hmm. you think that you're okay. Yeah. You can't. I think the biggest myth out here is that people think they can shoot somebody if they break into your house. If you are awakened by somebody downstairs in your house, mm -hmm. you go down there and shoot them, mm -hmm. you better be able to articulate that you were in fear for your life. You can't shoot them in the back if they're taking out your 45 right. inch <laughs> right. TV screen. That's not how it works. No, or you look out there and they're taking your brand new truck in your driveway. You can't shoot them. A lot of people don't know that. So you can go to jail. 
So this is something that I think everybody that carries a firearm should know, know the law. Absolutely. So we do, so we do that. So. Now, now um, with all this training, like how often do you really, do you offer this? Like, is it something that I can just contact you and, or do you have like specific classes? Sorry, I can't get the word out. Well, when we first started, I had a building over on Coleraine Road. And then somebody was in my class that worked for the chamber and said, we got a classroom over here, my Yeah. <laughs> so uh, I came over and it was a really nice classroom. Mm -hmm. I was using that and uh, that's why I'm doing it now. Mm -hmm. uh, I had some office out at Two Rivers Gun Range to use yes. their classroom, but they wanted me to pay them to teach their folks. Yeah. And I said, this is a collaboration. We got to yeah. work out. But we never came to an agreement. Gotcha. So now I'm using the chamber. We do try to do class, try to do classes at least once a month. Okay. Or when people call me or contact us on our website or through word of mouth, mm -hmm. we can arrange things. I've done one-on-one. -on -one. A lady called me about a month ago. She had just gotten a restraining order for her husband. She mm -hmm. was in, actually in fear for her life and for herself and mm -hmm. the two kids. And uh, she wanted to learn how to shoot. So I took her to the, had a class for her at her office. Yeah. Then we went to the range and shot and I'm taking her back to the range. So now, She's doing okay. She feels comfortable. So comfortable. you'll do these one-on-one -on -one classes oh, yeah, as well. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we do that a lot. Now, how can people get a hold of you? So if they do want to have some of these classes or they're interested in some of like um, the behavioral, the stuff, you know, yeah. looking for businesses, how can they get a hold of you? We have a, a, a Facebook page. Okay. It's Full Armor Training. Full uh, Armor Training. Full okay. Armor Training. We have a website, fullarmortraining.net. Uh, Real simple. Okay. Net. And uh, word of mouth and... Uh, Hopefully, uh, I got cars at the various pawn shops around here okay. to give out training. When people go to buy guns, the owners of the pawn shop have agreed that they need some type of training. Yeah. And they recommend me recommend people to me all the time. So well, we good deal. Training. Have we left anything out? I feel like we've covered a lot, but was there anything else you wanted to talk about? Yeah, I just think that uh, I appreciate what the Chamber's doing. Yeah. You know, I've met Thank a lot you. of people and... Uh, I see the website is growing. And, it is. We're getting know, there, Mr. There's some Jimmy. interesting businesses coming to Camden County, yeah. and I'm glad to be a part of that. Yeah. We're so glad you're a part yeah. of it. Now, you're going to um, you're gonna have to do the dance with me. Dance? Yeah. Does it involve shooting or fighting? No, none of that. Okay. None of that. It's All real right. simple. This is okay. going to be a real simple one. All right. I can do that. So, all right. Yeah. Well, thank you, Mr. Jimmy, for letting me get in get your on. business. <laughs> thank you guys for watching. Please like and share, and please visit Full Armor Training.